Hello everyone. Hope you all are fine. Today on a behalf of CCTV desk, we come up with new video. This video is all about a VCMS named as PNV2 for PC. So in this video, we are going to describe you that what is PNV2 for PC, what are its function and feature, what are its minimum system requirements, and after that we'll tell you what are its how you get the file, how you install the file, and how you after successful installation how you configure the software to make the camera live so keep watching please like share our video and subscribe to our channel press the bell icon so that you can get all the notification notification about our new videos so pnv2 for pc is a cms means it is the software which is used to connect as well as control the cctv cameras on pc it is also used to monitor the cameras on the remote location over the internet. This software allows users to remotely log into the devices to view the security camera live. The CMS is designed and developed by the ProVision ISI to help and connect the can to help and to help them connect and control the multiple brands of the CCTV cameras on PC. If we are talking about its feature and functions. By using this software, you can see the multiple channel at a time. Means you have a 16 channel in VR and you want to see the four cameras at a time, then it is possible by using this CMS. You can watch the remote recording of the cameras. You can take the snap of the videos. You can control the PTZ camera. You can save the live view of the camera. You can adjust the image parameters such as brightness, color, etc. You, you take the backup of the recorded videos. You can adjust the video streaming according to the network bandwidth. You can control the quality of the video recording and many more. If we are talking about its feature and its uh, minimum system requirements, then you should have at least Core i5 processor or equivalent processor in other companies. You should have Windows 8, 10, 11 or Windows 7. But I don't recommend using Windows 7 because that Windows 7 is quit by Microsoft. If we are talking about the RAM, then at least you should have 4 GB of RAM and after that we will tell you how much hard disk space needed so you should have at least 500 MB of hard disk free free space on your hard drive because this software won't take too much MBs in installation but when you see the live video sometimes you record the videos in your PC itself and sometimes you take the snapshot of the video so for these you should have at least 500 MB of free space on your hard drive now we'll tell you how you get the file, how you install the file and after successful installation how you configure the software to get the camera live and able to access all the features that we are discussing earlier in this video so keep watching.